Currently testing Grandmaster level chess aptitude. Chess aptitude? That's such an old school way of looking at it. There is a certain level of chess aptitude for sure. Or, apti yeah, there's the chess clocks and whatnot. They, they look a little bit stretched. That doesn't look like a real one. It looks like they, they, they bungled it up a little bit. And then we have chess moves and whatnot. But, like, you can have all the aptitude you like if you don't know how to play chess. And when I say how to play chess, I don't mean the rules of it. Ooh. Oh. Um, then you're not going to do anything. Your chess aptitude can suck a lemon. Okay, we're going to... I saw you twinkle at me. I saw you twinkle at me. Hmm, I'll get you. I'll get you. Let's see what we have in here. Authorized personnel only. Oh no. It's another one of these rooms. Was the other one a testing room? Oh, it's gonna be tricky for me to know what the heck I'm looking at. And the game knows. And the game knows. Two of them. Two of them. Two of them. I was betting on those. I think we're safe. Ultimately speaking, if there's no dead bodies around, I think it's unlikely that uh, there are monsters. Neural scan, patient not available. Everything is not available. Patient connectome must be updated with a, a recent neural scan in order to perform a successful aptoregressive neuro neurotomy. And we could do that. Apto regressive. That's probably aptitude regressive. That's probably what it stands for. Although that sounds, yeah. Uh, TS neural surgery system V1.8. This procedure will extract a designated neuro mod from the subject, returning the subject's memory to a period before the extracted neuro mod. And we can engage the surgical harness, but there's no patient. This might be where we got our surgery done. Uh, and then what's that? The brief. Subject may be confused upon awakening from their aptoregressive neurotom neurotomy, neuromod extraction, and could show erratic behavior. The following audio will assist patients in understanding what has happened and ease their shock. Well, I guess let's find out what we have heard, most likely. Hello, volunteer. My name is Bianca Goodwin. I'm the volunteer and guest liaison aboard Talos 1. I wanted to be the first person to congratulate you when you woke. On behalf of everyone at Transtar, well done and thank you. I'm sure you feel disoriented. This is because you've just experienced a medical procedure known as apto-regressive neurotomy. For the next few hours, you might have trouble with fine motor skills or recalling details. More importantly, your memory of the tests is completely gone. But don't worry. I want you to know your willing participation was a big success. It's already yielding valuable information for our scientists and engineers. So, please, rest easy for now. Once you feel well enough, I'll come by to conduct your exit interview. See you soon. Hello, volunteer. My I don't remember if we heard this. I don't think we did. It wouldn't make much sense if we had. But, yeah, no patient. But I think this means that the volunteers are basically people who have neuro mods that volunteer into losing their memories, basically, so that they, their neuro mod can be extracted and they're tested. Yeah, I told you they were friendly. And there are two neuro mods there as well, nice. And they're tested for that. Because, obviously, those have dire consequences. And that solves the issue with who the heck the volunteers are and what they're doing. Let's drop that. Because those are test tube samples. And I think we're going to get a lot of them around here. Know that, people. Medical Bay. Oh, it's the healing machines. Three. Okay. We got a med kit. Got a, uh, an oven. Anti-rat pharma fabrication plan. 
And it, sh it shakes that. And there's some cabinets up there. What is that? It's a... It's got a name. I don't know the name of that thing, but it is. It is that. Oh, there's two of them. Okay, always look up. Because these things... Yeah. Oh. That's very important as well. Always look into the fridges that don't look like fridges. Speaking of which... Yeah. They do not look like fridges. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, no. There's so much stuff in here. Oh, no. I've been missing things, haven't I? It's all right, I think. What is that? Weapon upgrade kit. Oh, I like that. Let's upgrade the shotgun. We drop you, right? We get that. Go in here. And upgrade the shotgun. Although, yeah. Four. Reload speed. No firepower. It's not that much, but it makes the bullets more useful. And the... What is that? Veggie blend. Was that like a saddle? salad? That sounds tasty. Well, hopefully it is, anyway. I find veggies can be... can When they go stale, they can be a little bit on the acidic side of things. This is a manual override. Were we here before? Mm, I don't think we were. So let's not be here right now. Let's go back to where we were. Yep, look at all the fridges. What is this? Null wave transmitter. Oh, it's junk. No, it is not. That is something. This is junk. What is that? An experimental device developed in the psychotronics lab, which discharges a signalifying pulse when detonated, can be thrown or attached to surfaces. Developed in psychotronics, the null wave transmitter emits a burst of signal that suppresses the psionic abilities of anyone caught in the blast for a short period of time. Uh, maybe you should expl- No, I don't want to have it equipped. It feels scary, and I don't like scary. I like nice in this game of, of bad. I like nice and good. Let's mess with this this thing. Cause I can't I can't do anything. Yeah, these these things are treacherous. Oh, it's accessible through here. I see it's this other area. Okay. And we probably were locked out from here. But what about this one? I think... There are no dead people around? No, this is the, uh... This is the entrance. Okay, we're safe. We're safe. Ooh, volunteer's quarters. We have the code now. Uh, let's go for it. Remember the thing I said about bad? Yeah, this is the sort of bad that I'm talking about. Uh, let's, let's do something before we go there. Just a little bit of exhaustion, don't worry. It's perfectly fine. So, transfer all the junk. And, uh, that's that. Turn it all into little cubes. Oh, that one is not a cube. It's exotic material. Which, of course it is, it's purple. And my inventory is really full. Can I turn all the booze and stuff? into that. Now, we still don't have a fabrication facility, which might be how we make first aid kits. But, for example, these. Does it work? Yes, it does. 
a lot of organic material and synthetic material as well. That's all right. Now we're going to the bed. Because the bad is really bad. Transtar. Scientific advancements at all turns. Why is the power out? Volunteer quarters. Authorized personnel only. No dead people. Disruptor stun gun fabrication plan. Recycler charger? Items confiscated in the latest shakedown. Re three recycler uh, recycling chargers. Wiring, plastic tubing, flask bourbon, and case of cigars. John, I take this stuff pretty seriously. I've already alerted Alex to the nature of this contraband. We're taking V01065537 out of here. Cigars and booze are one thing, but we can't have volunteers... Sp oh, that's the name of the volunteers. We've seen one of these p people before. They we can't have them stockpiling stolen recycler chargers. What do you think he plans to do from Bowser? Bowser is dead as well. These are things that we can throw. When detonated, the recycler charge breaks down the molecular structure of nearby objects into recyclable, recyclable material. Your uniform offers some degree of protection, but it is not fail-safe. Standing too close can prove hazardous. Recycler charges can be thrown or affixated to stationary objects using mouse one. I think I know what they're for. I think I know what they're for. They're for the doors that are broken. Oh, speaking of broken. Ah. That was, that is, that is jank. Don't worry. Yeah, these doors, that's what they're for. Weapon upgrade kit. Yes, we have one of those. Sunburst banana pudding. Oh, lovely. Ooh. The maintenance hatch. Are we going to turn the power on in here? Because my light is going out. This is really spooky. What do we have back here? No dead people. That's always a good thing. There's something up there. Oh. Huh. Uh. Yep, there's something up there. I can handle this. Glue cannon. Uh, it looks like... That is the best way. We got a wrench. Talos 1. That's just a, a vent up there. What about this? What the hell? Dead people. Dang it. Fabrication. Oh, that's where we are finally. That looks like a, an, a person who's alive, but it isn't. That person is very much dead. Also, there's a turret somewhere in here. I don't think it's in here. I think it's downstairs. Excuse me. Is it going to be one of those cases where your chair is bad? Got a bat battery optimizer. Oh, it's Rich Ivers. I need to... I, I'm sorry, I need to... It's, it's complicated. Because we need to find out where... The bad thing that killed you is. Oh, this is a freaking turret! I broke the turret. Ready to scan. Sorry. I know. Okay. Don't click and bip at me. 
There's couples of everything. My God. It's not the explosives. And this is Divya Nas. Which we also read about. No sign of what killed them. The neural horizon. The process doesn't hurt. Not at all. Brandy Grace speaks happily, enthusiastically. Her smile is radiant, her eyes bright. There's no hint of the paraplexies eating at her nerve endings. The Olympic medals lie in their glass cases, facing her like an audience. Quote, Yet I still had my love of skating, but the ski felt trapped inside my head. Or the skill felt trapped inside my head. The mods, unquote, she corrects. Quote, the neuromods allow that skill to be shared with others. A gift. Well. Yeah. Neuromods on the left? Potentially. No. There's some... They're not jiggling. They're good. Ah! Wow! What is that? What the hell is that? What? Okay, the robots are... Kinda good. I think I'm gonna need a shotgun for this. Although I'm sort of running out of ammo as well. Oh, it's coming in here. What the hell? What the hell? Okay, this does damage. Whoa, that does damage more. Okay. Let's take a healing kit. We got this. I think I killed the turret. I saw a turret broken. No, that thing is not going down. I'm not sure what I'm doing here, but I'm not doing it right. Oh, I think I, sh I need to shoot the, the eyes. Oh, it's... No, it's different. It's different. Let's get another heal. I don't like that. Wow. This thing is weird. This weapon is weird, and the enemy is weird. And I take damage for days. Okay. I also have this. What is going to happen with that? Did I kill it? I killed it. I can hack the turret. Why? It's broken. Did I kill the thing? Uh, I... Uh, should I have used the glue gun? I think I blew up... I blew something up. Typhoon organ. Really? There's a glandion here. I don't... 
get it. What is this? It's gas. It's bad. I don't know what happened to it. Okay. It's fine. It's all good. What happened to my other turret? What? I don't... I don't... Okay. It's just one of those things, you know? It's just one of those things. Man, that thing busting in here. Fortunately, there's another way of getting in, but... Freaking hell. It must have been the Glangion over here, whatever this is. So, my shots with the Disruptor stun gun were pointless. I think I did a lot of damage with the shotgun, but we're just gonna need more ammo for the shotgun. And these are... The little magnetrons things that we haven't tried out yet. I wonder I wonder if I can go in through here. Like you can see things in there. But you can't bring these up. And yeah, this looks like a bit of a dead end. So let's take the whatever these are. Simple elevator, huh? The do not enter is sort of weird. I wonder what happens if you do. Operator dispenser is password locked. That's a... What? It's not an issue. I don't know what it's password locked for, but let's find out. Getting better at this. Oh, science operators re remaining. What are they for? For science, naturally. Have I been here? I'm gonna say no. Recycler charges. Oh, it's another. It's a recycler, another one. This one looks different. I don't think I need these many. I'm actually relatively close to the other one. Cosmos flower cuttings. There's no dead people. Storage. Ooh. Door actuators are wonky. Come see me if you need it in. That's Graves. That is storage. So Graves disabled the door actuators for storage. I could force it open. I don't think I need to. Just need to go to their computer and mess with that. Oh! There's a secret passage over here. Look at that. There's something down there. Huh. Cool. Cool, cool. I like that a lot. Also, there's something up there. Oh! It's this room. Okay. We don't need to worry about that, then. It's the size of operators where it's at. So... There's dead people in here. Still don't know if these things can be... Can be cloned. Frederick Steele over here. And... Halden... Halden Graves' office key. What do you carry that for? Oh, that was a weird carry. Oh! You carry that so you can break the game a little. Do I break this? No, but there's definitely something down there. Oh, 
And one day I'll know. They literally could be anything. A broken fan. A broken turret. Huh. I don't think there's anything bad in here. I'm gonna say that whatever was bad in here, whatever killed um, whoever that person is, was the bad thing that attacked me upstairs. Because it's all the same room. It's a little bit of floating sickness going on with a physics engine. What do we have? A fabricator. Oh! I can't make shotgun bullets though. What are the 9mm bullets for? Sort. Oh, there's a, a weapon upgrade kit over here. For reload speed. Sounds good to me. So, I have the silenced pistol. It uses 9mm rounds. But is it the only thing? I have plenty of rounds for this. It's not too bad to use that. And we can make med kits and anti rad and huntress bolt casters. But not a whole lot of things. Unfortunately. Okay, well, we know where to get one of these fabricators. Even though getting in here might be. kind of tricky. Where are we? Where does this go? Oh, I know where it goes. To actual fabrication proper. We're in the upper hallway. Oh, you... Jerk. You had that open. You can't fool me. That was a bug, actually. Oh, they opened both. Oh, that's bugged. That shouldn't be like that. <laughs> Airlocks don't work like that. Although that might not be an airlock. That's me, who broke that window. And Tina Snow. Over here. With another weapon upgrade kit. So we don't know what killed her. It's possibly up there. It possibly is the machine that we don't like. But that does conclude this area. So let's try and see what this does. Not like that. Requesting new operator. Transfer civil 495 science class operator ready to deploy. Please stand clear of aperture. Dr. U profile indicates subject and researcher. Unusual. It's a science operator. Just that. That's it. Try deep storage if you need to access archived data. I don't know what that is. <laughs> I think that is really unusual and weird. But we can go into the Holden Graves now. Office. Holden Graves who might be dead. 